my favorite, my favorite thing is when you're in a science class and you learn something and then you connect it and you're like, oh my gosh, that's why this is this way. The people who take that class, physical science, it's a GE, and so it's people who aren't really interested in science. They don't really like it, they don't really care, and so if you're able to take science and make it interesting or make it funny, then they remember it, you know? I like to keep it fast-paced so they don't lose interest, so they don't, you know, get bored and fall asleep. I like to come up with stupid analogies and mnemonics. Mo most of these devices or these creative things I use to help them learn, most of them just happen on the spot. Like I'm, I'm in the review and I'm teaching them and, I, and it just pops into my head and I'm like, oh yeah, this is perfect. This is totally gonna help them learn. And it becomes like a permanent part of how I teach that. I like to make the concepts physical. So I have a couple things that I actually dance to. I am going to be the particle. She is going to be the scientist. Okay, so the purpose of this is she's trying to figure out whether I'm a particle or a wave. And what she's gonna do, what you're gonna do, is you're gonna go, I'm observing, I'm observing, I'm observing, I'm not observing, I'm not observing, I'm observing. And see what I do, okay? Because I'm the particle. I'm observing, I'm observing, I'm observing, I'm not observing, I'm not observing, I'm not observing. I'm observing. I'm observing. I'm not observing. I'm not observing. variations in the Earth's orbit is called the Milinkovitch cycle. There's the Earth's orbit going from spherical to elliptical, and then spherical back to elliptical. And then there's another one where the Earth's tilt goes back and forth, and then its tilt, or its axis wobbles. So we call it the orbit, the tilt, and the wobble. And so, <laughs> so I do a dance to help them remember. So I get my hips going for the orbit, <laughs> you know? And then I start doing the tilt back and forth, and then I do the wobble with my whole body. <laughs> so it looks ridiculous. It really does. Making it physical, I think, and ridiculous at the same time, you know, really helps people learn stuff. We have an interesting relationship. I call the students my children in science, <laughs> or sometimes I call them the, my science babies. <laughs> sometimes I make them call me dad, <laughs> or their father in science. I think it's the human interaction that I really that I really like, you know? Being able to help them learn something new and get into their brain and see how they think and then and then help apply that thing to them, you know, to their learning style. You can't get much more interaction with people than helping them to learn something.